Hey guys, it's Ayla. Today I'm doing a... a very different video. I did not want to start out this video by crying. <sighs> alright, alright, alright. All right. You guys can obviously see by the title of this video what this video is about. Yeah, Nate and I did break up. And... I don't want to hide this from you guys. It's already been... It's already been a while since we've been broken up. Um, I can't clearly remember. It's been like one, two weeks. Let me just start off by saying it hasn't been easy. Oh my god, no. If you guys are here, you guys probably already saw his video. If you guys haven't, then you guys can definitely go see his video on his channel. Um to see his side of what he said um just like he said in his video i'm not going to go into detail of what exactly happened um because we are going to make a video together and um we're going to make that video once we're ready just when we're both a little bit more calm collected and at a time when we're both ready to be on camera and let you guys know exactly what happened without us being super emotional we're gonna try not to be emotional it's honestly such a touchy subject and especially coming together with your ex significant other making a video explaining why things didn't work out is of course not easy so i know that this whole situation came to many of you as a big shock because as many of you may have known, we did have a YouTube channel together named Nate and I that Nate and I have been together for the past 10 months. I'll definitely always be grateful for Nate because he's never done anything wrong. He hasn't done anything but love me and really just do anything to make me happy. Just to think that things didn't work out because of one little thing is honestly, I mean, it sucks, you know? Nothing bad happened. I want you guys to know that. Nothing at all bad happened. If that were the case, we wouldn't talk at all. We would have no contact. We would just completely leave it dead. But him and I had something so beautiful. But I do want you guys to know that nothing bad happened we still love each other we still do talk and there's no hard feelings it was both a mutual breakup and that's what a lot of people are wondering if it was one person that broke up with the other if it was me or if it was him or if it was a mutual thing it was a mutual thing and so odd because it seems like normally people don't really break up mutually and to be completely honest, I am grateful that it wasn't a one-sided thing because if it was, I mean, it would hurt a lot more. Man, this is so much harder to make than I thought. Also, another thing that I did want to clarify is the fact that many people are saying that they think that I don't care simply for the fact because I've never posted him on my Instagram. That's not true. And that's a big problem on social media that if you don't post someone, if you don't post your significant other, people automatically think, yeah, this person doesn't care. The other person clearly cares a lot more. Let me just say something. Posting does not define your love for someone. There could be a cheater, which is not my case. There could be a cheater that posts you every single time, always posts you on their story, always posts you on their social media, is always saying all this sappy stuff, all this cute stuff, always giving you all these gifts and stuff. But that doesn't define how much someone loves you. I loved Nate so much, and I still do. I still love him so much. And yeah, I don't post him as often, but that doesn't mean that I don't love him any less than he loves me. But what matters most is that we know what we had and we know what we have. That's all that matters at the end of the day. It just matters if you both know that you love each other. It doesn't matter what other people on the outside looking in have to say because they do not know you like you know yourself. 
So that is one thing that I did want to clear up because I know for a fact how much I loved Nate and I still do. And our relationship simply just ended because we had different views on some situations and that was it. But I did want to come on here simply for the fact that I wanted you guys to also know because I know that we both don't have the same audience. Um, his channel was once Nate and I that and now it's going to be his own channel, Nate Wyatt. We will no longer be making videos together every single time he posts. I will definitely be in there once in a while, pop in, say hi. Simply because we have such a close bond, he is my best friend. And we have such a close connection. No matter us being in a relationship or not, we will always have a close connection. I think my body's just dried out completely of all tears. It's just, it's been a rough time, guys. It's truly been a rough time. No matter how happy someone seems on social media and how fine they seem on social media, you never know what's actually going on deep inside of them. And I feel like that's something that people forget about people with a following on social media. They think that everything is always smiles and rainbows and nothing phases them, but that's not true. We have feelings as well and we go through breakups, relationships end unfortunately and I want to ask you guys to please not send Nate any hate I want you guys to send him nothing but love please keep on supporting him like I know he wishes that you guys do the same for me nothing but positivity please send that over to him and I don't want you guys to ever think that we hate each other or that someone did something wrong because that is not the case it was just completely differences and opinions on a certain situation and that will be spoken about in an upcoming video that is all that i really have to say today because i just really don't know what else to say but besides that we broke up and we still care a lot about each other and i guess we'll just see what happens if something's meant to be it will come back but only time can tell i really hope this clarifies some of your guys' questions and yeah as always thank you guys so much for watching and i will talk to you guys in my next video